Hey, what's going on, y'all? So, <clears throat> today is December 30th, and uh, it's just now starting to get daylight. I'm here at the club hunting. I feel like I got a pretty good spot. It's just now starting to get good in daylight. I've been able to see the ground a little bit for a while, but I'm starting to get to where I can see farther. Um, I'm at the top of this pine tree, and uh, for everybody that knows me personally, they know this is not right for me. I, I, I hate heights. So uh, I'm gonna be in for a heck of a ride today. I already don't like this when the wind blows. I feel like it pine trees gonna touch the ground. But anyway, uh, there's a branch crossing right out here in front of me that I hunted opening day. And uh, I had pictures of a doe every day, if not every day, every other day. And a group of some bucks coming in. Hunted it all day, opening day, bow season, didn't see nothing. Um, and I had a camera down here behind me. Um, on a on a trail they was using through the woods and I've got a bunch of pictures on it and uh, Dad got my cameras the other day and brought them home to me. I ain't been up here hunting much. I ain't had time with work and school and everything. Um, but they've been some pretty good buck pictures on them, on both of them. But this and especially they've been showing up a lot. So I'm kind of in between them, but I'm just right here at this one. Uh, I kind of got to where I can see back towards that other one, but that other one's four or five hundred yards away from here. But I can see pretty good around me, so I feel like I got a pretty good spot. So it may have been all day sit. I know them bugs, the pictures have been in the evenings. Uh, I've seen does in the mornings. So I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But anyway, y'all stick around, and I hope y'all enjoy the video. I don't know about y'all, but I just love seeing the sun rise from a deer stand. There's just something special about it.
Alright, y'all. So I'm back here at the club again this evening. And, uh, I just busted some does out of here. I was hunting on that side of the branch yesterday, but the wind's opposite today. So, I can't hunt on that side. So I got on this side. Um, I'm in my hammock seat. Uh, so I'm gonna try this. Sitting here on the ground. One thing I can say is this mossy oak camouflage works real good. I uh, busted some does out of here when I was walking in. And uh, they kind of split up. And I've been getting pictures of them. I don't know what they are. It's two does and two fawns. Uh, not really fawns. They don't have spots. Yearlings, I guess. But uh, I busted them out. Stopped for a second. And I seen some go on around up to my left. And that one, they was more up to the right. But anyway, when I come through the branch, I heard that one um, grunting, I guess, and she wasn't grunting. But she, me, you know. So I stopped right there at the branch and just stood still, and I seen her come slipping up the branch. Me, looking for her mama, looking for the mother does. And she walked within 10 yards of me, me standing in the middle of a four wheeler road with my gun in my hand before she ever spotted me. She was fixing to walk right up to me, but he, so, but anyway, maybe uh, they'll come back or that buck will come through or something. Maybe we'll get it done this evening. We'll just have to see how it goes. Hey, what's going on, y'all? So, I'm back over here at the branch crossing, and I'm, which is where I seen that four pointer the other day, and uh, I was on that side of it the other day when I seen that four pointer. But I've moved over here to this side. And this is the way that doe come that I seen that evening. And this is the way that the bucks have been coming from the pictures from and videos from what I can tell. Um, I have seen horn push over here on this side and they several trails. So I'm expecting them to kind of come from behind me to uh, right in here, you know. And there's a road up this way that runs parallel to me and he's got a horn bush on the side of it and then there's a four wheeler road that comes off this side of me and I, I know them does like to walk that so we'll see how it goes maybe we get done this evening maybe at least see something um it's about four o'clock now I got in here a little bit late and uh it took me a took me a while to climb up this tree, having to trim limbs and everything. So we still got plenty of time, so we'll see how it goes.
Mẹ 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 He's right over there. Die. That's not what I was wanting to do. But he looked right up here at me. Well, it's gonna be hard for y'all to see. I've got a flashlight on, but I could be I I could see without the flashlight. But just barely. But I'm going to walk my tree stand over here to the road and sit it down. And then we'll go, we'll go look at him. I think he's a little sick. He might be a little eight. I ain't sure. But we'll see when we get over here. Maybe I'll be able to see him with my light. I think he's laying right. Yep. I see his horn. Alright. Take my headlamp off and shine it where y'all can see. Maybe. I don't know why I ain't picking it up that good. Y'all can kind of see some of the blood there. But a little sick. His body ain't that little of a body deer. But he's got them little horns. But I'm gonna work on trying to get him out of here. This ought to be fun. Hey guys, so I appreciate y'all watching this video. And like I said in that video, that wasn't the biggest buck ever. Um, I wasn't even planning on shooting him. I watched him walk down the trail, could have shot him several times. Just gonna let him go. But he walked right up there under my tree and looked right up at me. And in my mind, I was just like, no, we can't have this. I guess it was my excitement getting to me a little bit. That's the first buck with horns I've killed in two years. I've been trying to wait on a good one. That button head I killed with my bow this year was the first deer I've killed in two years. So I guess it was my excitement a little bit. But, I mean, I was happy with him. Everybody congratulated me on him. And, I mean, he'll eat the same. So... Like I said, I appreciate y'all watching this video. And, uh, you know, if this is your first time coming to the channel, consider checking out more videos on the channel and uh, seeing if there's anything y'all like and maybe consider hitting that subscribe button. But anyway, until the next video, y'all take it easy.